Hey guys, this is Garner the Young and I'm Vijay back with a new video. In this video, we are going to see about raking. It's a very simple step in gardening, but it is very important. This is going to be a beginner video, but it would be so useful to, to know why we should rake and how we should rake the soil, when we should rake the soil, etc. Before entering into the video, please do like, share and subscribe to our channel. Without any further delays, let's get into the video. Okay, now let's see what is raking the soil and how to rake the soil. Raking is nothing but mixing the top soil just to loosen it out. This will provide some aeration into the soil and the roots can grow really well. You can just mix the side of the roots. If this is the main part, you can just dig here. This would encourage more root growth. and the top soil as well just simply like this just the top like this just simply mixing the top soil is called as raking you may ask is it very important to rake the soil will it really help in the plants growth absolutely yes well this may look like one simple step but this is a very essential step because rather than adding a lot of fertilizers into your soil or doing any hacks on plants would just not help in you should also keep these sort of simple things in your mind to make your garden really flourish well you might ask is this simple raking will help in plant growth yes it absolutely does help in plant growth because it loosens the soil by loosening the soil the roots will get air the oxygen will be directly entering into the soil so due to increased amount of oxygen intake in plants the plants will really grow well the loose soil will also help in good root growth and if you mix the top soil the plants the weeds that are growing will be destroyed when you mix it so the germinating seeds of the weeds will also die and there are plenty of microorganisms present in the soil they will also need oxygen for breaking down the particles in the soil into smaller molecules which can be taken up by plants and if the soil is so tight then what happens is there is chance of fungus growth because of uh, water clogging as well as there is no oxygen so anaerobic respiration takes place by the bacteria or any fungus so that will cause root rot problems so there's a chance of a deadly disease on your plant so this is better if you do it weekly once or twice whenever you add fertilizers just rake the soil and add fertilizer that would make the fertilizer we added fastly soluble in the soil and easily available to plants so this will surely increase the productivity of the plant it will make your garden flourish and the harvest will also be increased so it's very simple but it it is a really good thing to do in garden but is it naturally done anywhere around in nature yes absolutely yes we are not only doing it artificially it is also done to every plants around us naturally in forests or the trees nearby earthworms uh, digging animals like rabbits snakes ants all these sort of animals will create holes there there and then in the soil these holes will help in uh, aeration of the soil which will in turn help in plant growth see how nature is beautifully designed to form a beautiful ecosystem they help each other in their growth so we should also try to learn from it root growth will help in more absorption of nutrients by the plant and which will make the plants grow really well and will give a lot of harvest i hope you found this video useful this is all about raking do this simple step in your garden and get a lot of harvest thanks for watching please do like share and subscribe to our channel happy gardening friends bye bye let's meet in another great video bye bye friends